Hi, I'm Debbie DiBattista. And I'm Tom DiBattista, and we've been going to Upper Dublin Luther Church for 12 years. We have two kids. Um, Adam is 16 and Ayla is 18. What we were looking for when we came to Upper Dublin was a new church home. Um, we were going to another Lutheran church and it was undergoing some transition. We really wanted a strong foundation for our kids. And we were looking for something that was friendly, um, that we could relate to, and that had community outreach, and that was good for our kids. So we really felt Upper Dublin was our home when we came for the first time. Um, the music was amazing. We really liked the contemporary music. The engagement around the kids during the service was amazing. I think it was Holy Humor Sunday. Might have been. Um, the kids really loved it. Yeah, it was super entertaining. They were in costume. It was a whole thing. Um, and when we got into the car, I can vividly remember kind of both of us looking at each other. And Tom turned to me and said, what do you think? And I said, well, what do you think? And he said, I really liked it. And I said, so did I. And we never returned to our other church. We have been here ever since. My favorite memories from Upper Dublin always were around Tuesday nights. Um, my kids, like I said, were chimers. And so we would come for their chiming practice. And then afterwards, actually, they would go outside in front of the church and just run for like another hour together and like play together and the giggles and the relationships that were formed during that time. It was really special. Yeah, I think also that you know, because Upper Dublin introduced us to Bear Creek Camp, mm -hmm. um, and our kids have gone there for many years. In fact, our son still goes, and they find that place very special. What we appreciate most about the ministries at Upper Dublin is that they, they there's so many that you can belong to, and just that um, everybody's friendly, and you can join whatever you want, and you have the ability to choose. Yeah, it's just really nice. There's just a lot of opportunities to get involved, and find kind of your niche. We choose to support Upper Dublin with our financial gifts because we feel like it's an extension of us and what we would like to give to either community outreach being local or global. Um, and just that we know that our gifts are being put to good use. I think our greatest hope for future UDLC and, and members that come here is for them to find their place, to feel welcome, to feel loved. Yeah, just for everybody to feel as though they have a place that they can call sort of their second home, where they feel loved and accepted just for who they are, and that the ministries continue to evolve and develop to include as many people as possible and get people involved and feeling good about what they do and how they can get back to the community. Yeah, I mean, I think it's like, Debbie said that it's great, even though our kids, you know, have grown up, they still feel welcome here and we hope everybody feels welcome at Verdun.